hello everyone welcome back here in this new video tutorial in microsoft excel today we are going to learn how to calculate the total or sum of every nth arithmetic sequence of columns here i have taken a small data for example but in real case the number of column in the data may be big like if you have 300 or 400 columns and you have to get the total from every nth column that you require the nth column may be anything like fourth column or second column or third column anything can be there and to do this kind of calculation we have to combine four different functions these are sum product n mode and column so now let's go here in this cell and start writing the formula press equal to then type the sum product formula first you can double click this now combine the n formula open bracket then again combine the mod mode formula open bracket here in the number of the mode formula we have to combine column formula open bracket in the reference of the column formula select the data range now close the column formula by giving bracket give a comma now here in the divisor we have to put 4 because we are going to get the total from every fourth column so this n value will come here in the divisor if you are going to get the sum from every second column then here you need to put 2 so here i am typing 2 in the divisor typing 4 not 2 4 in the divisor then close the mode function then we have to press equal to 0 here now close the n function and this combination of n mode and column will work as a array 1 of the sum product now give a comma and in the array 2 of the sum product again select your data range now close the bracket and press enter and here you will get the total of every fourth column value that is if you manually add these four column values that result is 99 and our result is also 99 now you can go here in the fill handle then drag this down and here you will get the total of every fourth column values and here you need to take care of one thing that is if your data is not starting from the first column sometime your data may start from some other column like if you have these two column here now your result will be wrong in this case you have to subtract the extra column that is at the left of your data here i have two column at the left of my data so here i need to subtract two from the column formula that is used here after this column formula here we need to subtract the extra column here we have to put minus two after the column formula then press enter again your result will be correct so this you need to take care of while writing this formula and if you want to understand what is the logic behind this calculation what is the role of every single formula here for getting the total then you can go below in the video description where you will get a link for a article by going into that article you can understand the role of every single formula here in this combination so this is all about the process of calculating the sum of every nth arithmetic sequence of column in excel thank you very much for watching this video we will again meet on next video tutorial